Uh, what do you what do you think Chris Weidman should do after, after retire? Retire. Yeah, I love Chris Weidman. I love him. I love his family, and I, I think he should retire. Uh, we talked to Doc D. Doc D thinks he blew his MCL, ACL. He blew one of the CLs, and uh, you know, guy's just coming back from a gruesome injury, and and you know, listen, man, Father Time is not our friend at all, but definitely if you're a professional athlete, it's. So if he comes up to you and says, I want one more fight, is that something you say like, hey, maybe let's talk about well, this? Well, first of all, the, depending on the damage to the knee, you're talking another year. So I would, I would say, Chris, I love you. Please, please retire. We talked to Joe Lozon yesterday at a QA. and a This is the first New England card you guys have held where there's no New Englanders on it. He said that he had hit you guys up a bunch to get on this card. Right. And that he was told his services weren't needed. Um, it wasn't that services weren't needed. The card was full at the time that he was asking. We already had the card full. Gotcha. So, like, you're cool with offering him fights if he wants to fight again? I would like Joe to retire, too. You know what I mean? It gets to the point. It's like Chris Weidman. We're talking about Chris Weidman a minute ago. Weidman reached the pinnacle of the sport and did it in spectacular fashion, knocking out one of the greatest of all time, right? And what's now why you know what i mean to come back and feel it one more time he felt it tonight and he blew his knee out and he's gonna have to go through crazy surgery again and recover from it it's just like why you've already done it all you've accomplished everything that you could hope to accomplish in the usa and last and, one and and saying that so is joe lozon joe lozon at one point held like the most uh fight of the night bonuses or performance bonuses or whatever it was you know he, he's been a part of the ultimate fight. He's done, he's done so much in the sport. You get to an age where it's just like, come on, guys. 